I'm Maria Boynton, and today we are talking to some gentlemen from the Delta Mu Mu chapter of Omega Sci-Fi Fraternity. And of course, we're talking about Vontel Johnson and Bruce Demps, and they're here today to talk about their inaugural P3 experience, which is happening on August 30th. Welcome. Good morning. Great to be here. Thanks for the opportunity. What is P3, Mr. Demps? P3 is a new experience. Pino, paintings, and poetry. The whole concept is to have people come together in a great venue uh, and enjoy wine, art, and spoken word. As an event connoisseur, someone that has traveled the world and they've experienced tons of experiences, talk to us about your thoughts on our P3 event tonight. Well, especially for it to be the inaugural event, I thought that it went away just really flawless and I had a great time from beginning to end. I mean, greeted, everything was organized, found my name, you know, whether you had a ticket or your name was on the list, you got in, then you escorted to the wine area, which is always good, okay? You get your wine, you get your little bites, and um, you go upstairs, and then I got a piece from Monica Tooks, who I'm familiar with. I like the artists that were featured here. And then, let me tell you, the spoken word, the poetry, mm -hmm. unbelievable. I had a great time from start to end. When it comes to all three Ps, what was your favorite in the event? I would have to say the poetry. Um, it's been a while since I've um, been uh, able to see some spoken word and poetry or whatever, so I really gravitated towards that. Now, wine, I will have that anytime. Okay, and it was great wines tonight, but that poetry piece and the people from Clayton County came and represented the North Side. And when I tell you, I had a great time, I had a wonderful time. How you felt about the events? 
the event was great. Uh, enjoyed the paintings that I saw, the music, the food was wonderful, the atmosphere definitely was wonderful. The ambiance was definitely wonderful. So another great event. It's Pino, it's painting, it's poetry. What was your favorite piece? The poetry. The poetry was the best. Uh, the guy who just, he made you just think and hit the images. He was digging deep. So for those who didn't make it this year, why should they come to next year's event? Because it's a wonderful event. Um, you're outside, inside, great ambiance. Wonderful event, as my sister said. Uh, great venue. You have pino, paintings, poetry, everything cultural. So that's definitely the reason someone who didn't attend this year should definitely come next year. Sitting here with some distinguished men of Delta Mimi's chapter. Uh, we'll start with Brother Vontel. Your thoughts on the first P3 experience? Thank you, Ryan. This is an event that has been in the books for about four years, actually. Uh, the bros decided to actually um, pull it out of the wrappers, if you will. Um, where can you go out and have an evening of wine, poetry, art, spoken word, along with a silent auction? And so uh, we decided to combine all four elements to come up with the P3 experience. And so uh, I think for our first event, it went well. I got to give thanks to all the brothers, the chapter brothers, the uh, the committee for working hard and uh, reaching out and selling tickets and promoting this event. Uh, I think we're off to a good start. We've been looking for a second signature event to offset sundresses and seer suckers. Well, well Tubbett, I was going to say, you've been around since the beginning of the chapter. Talk about some of the evolution of the chapter as well as your thoughts on the P3 experience. Yeah, I mean, basically the chapter, I mean, we're, we're, we're a chapter that thinks outside of the box. So basically, this this is something that has never been done by a Greek letter organization of, of Omega, for that matter, in the, in the city of Atlanta. So we're looking at an opportunity to continue to enhance that. Um, Pinot culture and painting was something that Brother Vontel had talked about for years, and so we actually bring it brought it to fruition. Um, also, as far as all of the participants, we want to say thank you for all the activities that you provided for us. I think our patrons had a great time, and we want to continue to move on the momentum from this event. Happy to spend some time post-event with the boss list of the chapter, Delta Mew Mew, Brother Reginald Carson. Thank Brother Carson, how are you, sir? I'm outstanding, bro. It's, it's, it's a great event. We're actually very proud of what we've done, and we're proud of what we're going to be doing in the future. Bro, several people came up to me and said this could not be the inaugural P3 event, bro. Just put a little bit of thought and um, some comments behind what it took for all this to take place. Well, we're really blessed because we have several brothers in the chapter that have very certain niches. One of the niches that we have is our chairman right now put together an outstanding event. This is our fall event that comes back from our Sundresses and Seersucker event. So we pretty much have the pieces in place. It's just getting them up to speed. And we're always partying with the purpose whenever we do anything, raising money for our youth, trying to help the community, tell the folks where their hard-earned money went 
behind the P3 experience? We have a lot right now. We're doing our Coaches for Cancer. We do our Black Rhinos Foundation. We've given out almost close to $100,000 in scholarships to African American youth. So the money goes a long way. We always need more. We always need more, but it's good to know that we have uh, patrons that actually participate and contribute to what we're doing right now. You're doing the job well done in office, sir. Thank you very much, sir. But too often, Omega is a stereotype with the whole image of party central. Instead, we are men of distinction, men of talent, men of education and intellect. What's your favorite P in the three? I have to say it's the Pinot. The Pinot. Yes, okay. absolutely. Did you learn anything about the wines while you were here? Absolutely. I learned more about how to choose the wine that I might enjoy. Um, they taught me a little bit about some different wines that I had never tried before, so that was great. This P3 event is our first time doing it. Okay. Give us your thoughts on how we've done so far to this point. Oh my God, I thought this event was something that you all have been doing for years, actually. Very well put together. I love the art showing. Uh, the, the entertainment was great, especially the spoken word.